Hi everyone. I haven't been consistently uploading because I just don't know what to film because the issue is I don't have a specific niche for my content. I haven't found my niche yet. So yeah, for this channel, I'm just uploading random stuff. I don't like to be put in a box in the sense of I want to upload whatever I want. You know what I mean? Like I I know that my subscribers followed me for a specific con like for a specific type of content, but I don't like to make specific type of content. I feel like a lot of my some of my subscribers end up like un probably un unsubscribing because they're like, "Oh, like why is she making this random con like this random video now because it doesn't relate to her all her other stuff." Like I could probably the next week do a makeup tutorial i don't know like next week i could probably do like um best lip oil of the year and then the next week later on i will probably do like top 10 books that i love I, I don't know like it's really hard for me to find one thing to just record because i love recording random things so i have an issue and it is loneliness it's quite hard to um deal with the loneliness because i have two close friends that i feel yeah i i, I believe that those two people are close to me and we are close friends and you, you know i have you know a cousin who i occasionally speak to but everyone just has their own life going on you know everyone might be at work because i mean i have um a boyfriend and he's always at work and you know i don't mean to <sighs> talk bad about him but he has his discord friends you know he has a community that he can go to i have friends that i i love dearly but they occasionally are at work so i have a friend who um her co-workers are people that she talks to daily i'm unemployed like i think if you are new to this video i mean new to this channel you know that i'm i'm literally a neat right now so what am i to do even with people who are neats like i have a cousin who is technically a neat right now and she has people to go to she has like I don't have friends on discord okay so if someone says oh like since everyone you know has friends on discord why don't you get friends and you can't it's it's complicated it's way more complicated and for me i feel that i don't have a community that i belong in i love books i love um i love music i love you know i love reading i feel like reading and writing is one of my passions okay one of my greatest interests I don't think I belong in actually I haven't really tried you know what let me just sum it up I have been through so many discord servers and so like I've talked to people I can share their interests but I don't belong I don't I just don't feel like I belong I just don't think that anyone has ever like a hundred percent I don't expect people to hundred percent understand me but I just feel I just don't feel like I belong. I just don't think planet Earth was even for me. I think that when I pass into a different realm and dimension, I believe that that is where I truly belong. Ever since I was a child, I would never feel like I belonged. And I was actually pretty lonesome as a child. But, you know, later on, I met friends and all this. I had friends. I'm not going to deny the fact that I have friends. However, did i feel like i belonged not necessarily there are people who understand me there are people who are great at understanding me it's not that people don't understand me i i think that i am in good friendships and relationship and a relationship now however i just don't I don't know. I think it's probably because of the fact that I just have nothing going on with my life. And 
everyone around me they have their own things going on and there's just some sort of wish that i had my own things going on to distract the fact that i will forever feel lonely i don't even have anyone to talk to right now daily and they say loneliness is actually really bad for someone that is actually ba really bad for someone's health and sometimes I feel that my heart hurts because I just feel so lonely. Honestly, it, it sometimes it's, it's good to be lonely and it's good to have no like barely any friends because I dread like having to go to, like imagine you have to go to so many like these baby showers and like weddings and you have to oh god I don't want to do that. No offense, I feel like not to be rude, but I don't like attending these things. I don't. It's just too much. It's too much for me. I'm okay with not having many friends as well. But sometimes I just wish I could find at least some sort of community in which I belong. But I don't think I belong in a community. It's hard for me to be friends with people. And I know that beggars can't be choosers and all this kind of stuff. However, I don't want to be in a friend group where I'm not acknowledged or people don't understand me. People don't, people don't understand my humor. People don't have the same interests as me. I don't. I also don't want to be friends with someone who doesn't understand my humor, like I said, doesn't, you know? So what is the point of that? I don't respect those types of friendships because it's like, what, like, People who are friends with everyone are people I don't trust solely because it's like you can't be friends with everyone And it's not like you could be acquaintances and you could be nice But if you're a friend to all you're a friend to none and I truly believe this quotation with the idea of you know having no friends um, Being very strict with the quality of friendships. I have it's very it, I'm bound to be lonely and it's not it's not like I'm complaining. It's more so of just me saying that, you know, it's sad to be lonely. Some people have friends for different reasons, right? Like, oh, I have a friend to go to this with. I have a friend to whatever, whatever. I don't like that. Because when you are a friend to me, I don't want to use you. And I don't want to see you as, oh, you are a friend that I, I go to play golf with. I feel that friendship is very is still intimate it's still important and i think quality is way more better than quantity I know that might be cliche but i truly believe that and i practice it i had a failed friendship with someone who definitely traumatized me i'm not going to lie like i had a friendship that traumatized me which really made me more antisocial and it made me really picky about who i have close to me because i don't want to be hurt again i am lonely i am very lonely this is not i don't know man like i just wanted to rant and also i just hope that someone may have looked at this video ew why did i say video like that what the hell am i Sorry. I hope someone saw this video and was like, you know what? Flora, Flora's hormones has a point. Or if you relate, this video is not a guarantee we're gonna be friends. I. It's not a. It's not a be my friend video. It's it's more so of a. Uh, I hope you can relate, and I hope you know that many people are super lonely. I don't even care anymore. Okay, I'm lonely. I'm just gonna deal with it. Sometimes you will always be lonely and you just have to adapt and then, yeah. Okay, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoy low quality content like this because I don't know, I feel like low quality content feels more authentic because it's like, I'm not really Cause I'm not like I'm not like talking to you in a way where I'm like oh I'm no one I'm gonna get views and I'm gonna profit off of you. It's more so of like oh like here's me talking to you. That's it. Loneliness is okay. There are many people who are lonely in this world, and you can either complain or you can adapt to it or you can fix it. For me, I'm going to complain and adapt to it, but 
I just don't think I'm gonna complain anymore because it's like alone you're alone right you just have to adapt to it and um you know, if you're religious you can talk to god right i speak to god when i'm bored as hell in this household bye thank you so much for watching